Of course, your man Diamond K in here, Radio on Fire, on Fire TV. I have a special guest in the building, and um, she has so many things going on. Uh, <laughs> Tony Walker, welcome to the show. How you doing? I'm well. How are you today? I'm great. I'm great. So where are you right now? Um, well, I'm at my location. I'm a business owner, entrepreneur for Serendipity Salon in Owensville, Maryland. And um, I specialize in hair care and skin care. Wonderful, wonderful. So uh, Owens Mills, uh, love the area. And so you have a salon. And, and so let, let's go back to the beginning. Let's talk a little bit about your journey. What got you into this line of work? Um, so my aunt started me off um, at, I believe it or not, at the age of 11 as a shampoo assistant. And from there, um, I went to cosmetology school when I turned um, 15 years old in Owens Mills. And from there, I got licensed and then pretty much I started into the career. Uh, I probably went to a lot of advanced training courses for um, becoming a top colorist, master weaver, um, a trichologist, um, and then also a line of different type of weaving and wig techniques and different things like that. All right, so that that sounded interesting. So let th there was one word that really stuck out, like the trichologist. Let's talk yeah, yeah. a little bit about that. What is a trichologist? So a trichologist deals with the study of the hair and the scalp and its disorders. Um, so basically just specializes in that part in order to figure out exactly what's going on with that particular client's needs for their hair and their scalp. Um, and that, and that's from, important. That, yeah, yeah. That, that, that is important. I, I guess yeah. that is the, the foundation for everything um, that yeah. you do with regards to the hair, which is the scalp. So so do you find that a lot of a lot of people don't pay attention to the scalp or, or um, why um, so is that uh, so important? Yeah, so basically, my, I feel like my clients do. Um, however, um, at this point, a lot of stylists, um, it seems like when they come to me, my clients, they're letting me know that a lot of people don't offer them hair care services or scalp care services or just basic maintenance, um, moisturizing, trimming, um, anything of that sort. So I step in and I let them know like, hey, these are the things you need to do in order to maintain your hair in order to keep it healthy. And as long as you do those things, um, a lot of times any other thing you want done in the future, it makes it easier on your hairstyles. Whether or not you're doing leave outs, natural hair care, chemicals. So, yeah. Yeah. And, and so those are all styles that you do. You you um, you do natural hair and then yeah, so you know, natural whatever. hair, chemicals. Um, I do also like Brazilian blowout treatments. Um, I do, you can come in for a hair and scalp analysis um, if you want me to determine exactly what's going on with your hair and your scalp, um, the density, the porosity, what we can and can't do to your hair type, that type of thing. And then also anything from braiding, coloring, um, barbering, you name it, I do it pretty much to the hair. Oh wow, that that is really cool. So this is not just a salon that women can go to, but men can go and get service as well. As well. Yeah, that, that is good because a lot of times I feel that we are left out of the equation. Like nobody oh, thinks no. about us. I mean, the barber shop. We definitely, about. we definitely include the men and we okay. welcome them definitely. Wonderful, yeah. wonderful. Um, and, and so uh, as far as your salon. You have a, a an official grand opening happening. Yes, this uh, will talk be, a little bit about that. Yep, this Saturday coming up, July the first. Okay. Um, it's going to be prizes, giveaways, um, a lot of promotional items, raffles. Um, so um, what is it? Product raffles, service raffles. Um, some Telfar bags are going to be um raffled off. Different things like that. Absolutely, absolutely. I'm gonna be in the building on the turntables. Yes. 
yes, yes, you yes, yes. Yeah, so I'm looking, I'm looking forward to it. Um, and uh, <laughs> as far as the name, serendipity, where where does the name come from? It is definitely a name that stands out. So basically, um, it's finding something beautiful without looking for it. Right. Um, a lot of my clients pretty much stumbled across me, and it's like, where have you been all this time? So they meet me in a kind of like serendipity type of way. Yeah, yes. yeah, that is that is that is cool, and um, uh, I, I really I like that. And, and, you know, to be a a hairstylist, um, I think that a lot of folks don't. It doesn't really dawn on people a lot of times that this is the customer service industry like you have to have a certain a certain level of professionalism a certain level of appeal being able to talk to people and you you just have this personality that you know you can really see that you can be successful and you have been successful in in this business so you have a great personality um Thank you. Thank yeah, you're welcome you're welcome so uh you have a salon you have um uh booths people can come rent are you looking for other people to come to the salon to work definitely um looking to hire um licensed they can be licensed cosmetologists like myself they can be licensed barbers licensed esthetician licensed nail technicians um braiders they could be a braider um bufreno commission is up to them um but yes definitely um needing a little bit of help over here because look i'm just one person and I definitely would like to be a blessing to others in order to, um, you know, build up their clientele and their book. And I do in salon training as well. So you don't oh, have to know everything. I can actually help you out. Right. And so um, uh, as far as appointments, uh, we were talking off uh, off air. Uh, people can call you, of course, 410-504-4530 uh, to schedule an appointment. Uh, yeah. But they can also go to the website. Yes, yes, yes. Or they can drop by. Obviously, you got plenty, plenty of free parking. That's that's you know, parking is. I don't know if people always, um, you know, pay attention to this when they when they start a business or you have an event. Parking mm -hmm. is so important. Parking can be the difference between whether you go somewhere or you don't go. Uh, um, and you have plenty of free parking. Uh, yeah. Which is and enough. handicap. Look, handicap. Handi handicap. You always talk about that. I, you mentioned, you mentioned that a few times. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I because you know, I, I do. I have people. Yeah. Yes, I do have people. Um, definitely. So I always say locations, everything. Um, and just as a business owner, um, to make it as convenient and comfortable for the client is definitely good customer service. So yes. Um, and so as far as social media, you're on social media. Do you like social media? Um, so <laughs> it's not that I don't like it. Okay. Um, I don't get it. I guess the opportunity to be on it as much as I would like. Yeah. Um, I, it's definitely a tool that I find in this business. I obviously need to start using more of, um, but not, look, not to tell my age or anything. I'm, 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 I'm learning. Yeah. Along with some of my other peers, my age, yeah, how to yeah. do all the social media stuff. Yeah, but the I social don't media is it. great. It's a, it's like you said, it's a great tool uh, yes. because you know you're in the beauty industry. You know the uh, hair care, self care, all that kind of stuff, yes. and people want to see those photos and you you know put those before and after yes. pictures, like you know you have on your uh, on your social and. You know, just just showing different things. I'm going to be on social media uh, at your event Saturday, and okay. yeah, yeah, so it's just it's it's um it's it's a it's a great way to get folks to see what they are missing or what they can you know get. Uh, so yeah. it, you know, the photos and the videos is all a good thing. Um, so a lot of times, well, not all the time, but a lot of times, people who do hair. They theirs doesn't look the best all the time because they're busy doing other people's. But oh, yours yeah. looks great, and you you have. Oh, thank you. And I think it's good because you know, especially especially ladies, right? I, even for <laughs> us, you know, the person who does your hair, you mm -hmm. you automatically look at theirs first. I think you look at theirs first. And now some people are like I don't have time. I'm busy doing this. But it's really good when the person who is in charge of your hair looks great as well. Of course. So I, I think that's. I important. mean, the way you present yourself sometimes invites other people in 
and makes them feel comfortable enough to sit in their seat. So yes, that makes perfect sense. Yes, yes, um, yes. And then I always say self-care is important. So if you don't take care of yourself, how can you even take care of really anybody else? So it starts with you and then everything else. Kind of like yeah. being on an airplane. What they say when it's starting to crash? You put the <laughs> mask on yourself first. Right. And then you're supposed to help with the other Right. Person. I love that. Yeah, you're absolutely right. Absolutely right. This is Tony Walker here on the Diamond K Show. Uh, Serendipity Salon. Uh, located in Owens Mills, Maryland, 9129 Ricestown Road. So we're talking about this grand opening. What is the future? What What does the next five years look like for you, Tony? Um, definitely um, building my brand. So I do have um, my skincare and hair care line, which is the El Labelle products. So it's for healthy hair and skincare. Um, non pathogenic fragrance free products for the skincare and um, also is launching a organic line as well. Um, and then so basically building that brand up um, is named after my daughter. Um, she's she's only one years old, but yes, her name is Elle. So it's called Elle LaBelle. And then also um, I'm working on continuing. So I, it's also nail care. So it does have a nail bar. Um, I also do makeup and also, of course, the skincare, which would be your facials. Yeah. As well. Yeah, and that, waxing. that is really good. Also that waxing. Good. Yeah. So, uh, so really, truly a one-stop shop. So they can get, get all of that. And uh, I love the brand building. And of course, you know, it, take, it, it takes time to build a brand. And so you're in this for the long haul. You've been doing it for a long time. Yes. And uh, 24 years in county. Yes. Nobody believes that. So you start. You, I know. You nobody started this when you were five. No. So I got licensed, like I said, so sixteen. So yeah, twenty-four years. Yeah. Yeah, and and then so um a lot of uh I don't know I guess it was maybe ten years ago, maybe mm -hmm. ten years ago I started to see this trend of these um these buildings where you have a lot of salons in them, and they're okay. kind of like you know people. Salon yeah yeah right so so that that started but what i've been starting to see now is the trend back to uh the more traditional setup yeah. for the salon so what explain that uh that trend to me like what what happened what caused it and <laughs> okay. where is it, what is it what's it doing now no i i thank god i've never experienced where i didn't get along with people in a salon setting Mm -hmm. um, I've been in salons with 16 people, 10 people, two people, or one person, just myself, okay? Um, so I thank God, like I said, I get along with everybody. But some people, um, I don't know, they co don't coexist well with other stylists, or they want to go off and do their own thing. So I found that independently, they said, I'd rather be by myself and just with my clients. And then some clients want you only exclusively to yourself. Now, in the cases that my clients want me only exclusively to myself, I either go to them, like actually travel to them, but that's an additional service. So you would pay for the time that obviously you want individually set for you, which is fine. Um, but mostly they want it to be by themselves doing the services. However, if you're just starting in the business and you're trying to build your clientele, it may not be the best option because you're self-employed at that point. You have to do your own everything. And if you don't have the clientele, that means you won't have the weekly booth rental. Um, but if you do have the clientele, then it can be a blessing, definitely, because obviously you're able to take care of what you need to take care of in, the, in your business. But um, for people just starting out, you don't have the clientele, I always say try to do commission until you build yourself up. And then once you build yourself up in your brand and what it is that you want to promote, then you go out and you can become um, self-employed, whether or not you have a location like mine or a location that may be smaller, intimate, like a salon suite. Right. So. Right. And, and I'm glad that you broke that down because, like you said, the the importance is building your uh, client list. And yeah. sometimes, you know, you, you got to what they say, you got to you got to walk before you can run and, and, and yeah. crawl before you walk and all that kind of stuff. And, yeah. and it's all in the steps that you take. Yeah. And I think sometimes people maybe skip some steps 
Yeah, I, I will say this. I, I did commission for probably about what, three, four years before I even went to be in like a booth rental situation. Mm -hmm. so, yeah. yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. Uh, again, we've been talking to Tony of Serendipity Salon. They specialize in hair and skin care. All right, you know, you can't see that. All right, specializing in hair and skin care located in Owens Mills, Maryland. You can yes. see the website there. You can book or get more information at the website, the serendipity salon.com. You can call 410 504 4530. There is a grand opening this weekend, July the 1st. July 1st, correct. July the 1st, 12 to 3. Come on out, and uh, it's going to be a whole lot of fun. Um, and, you know, you can see some of the things that uh, that the salon offers. Thank you so much, Tony. Oh, no problem. It's been my pleasure. Thank and, you for and, having me. Absolutely, absolutely. So I don't don't be a stranger. You can definitely okay. come through uh when <laughs> whenever you have uh you know something going on that you want to talk about, definitely. Uh thanks again. And uh want folks to check it out. Serendipity Salon, 9129 Ricestown Road in Owens Mills, Maryland. Uh go to the website, the serendipity salon.com. Thank you so much, Tony. Thank you. Have a blessed day. You too. Thanks. Get lit, get lit, get lit, everybody get lit right now, get lit, get lit, get lit, everybody get lit right now, Park Heights get lit right now, EA get lit right now, Sandtown get lit right now, RNG get lit right now.